If you like our channel, please subscribe and also click the bell notification so you have the latest videos when we release them. Hey crew, welcome back to our channel. We are continuing with our trying to get fit over 40 videos. Remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell notifications. It really helps us out. You can also find us on Facebook and Instagram. The links are in the descriptions below. One reason we are doing these is to help us stay committed to staying fit and healthy for our family. And hopefully it will give you an idea or two you can use in your daily routine and or may motivate you to join in with us. Leave a comment below if you like this video and if you have any great healthy breakfast ideas. Breakfast burritos we really enjoy. So today I'm going to just show you a few ingredients that we put in our burritos that make them scrumptiously delicious for us. We like the red onion. I also use white onion. I just didn't have any today. Mushrooms. Mm, not my favorite. Jareth loves mushrooms though, so I always add mushrooms. And spinach. Spinach is very good for you. Um, nice green veggie and I always snap the ends off. The ends are a little tough when you go to eat them. So I usually snap them off and I um, break them apart. This helps them cook nicer and we enjoy spinach. Ah, Cole and Jared. <laughs> they enjoy the bell peppers. Um, bell peppers are colorful. We use the colorful ones. You can use green ones if you like. We like the colors. <laughs> Cole's trying to cut it with his left arm due to his right broken arm that he broke pitching. Oh, James mm, did not like the smell. Everybody else did. We wash our veggies. You should always wash your veggies because you never know these days what's in the store and what's growing on them as they come into your home. Again, I chop them very finely. Especially peppers, they um, take a little bit longer to cook sometimes. We don't like them too crunchy, so I do cut those small. Rock made his appearance. He's back there in the background. I think he was waiting for food. He's always hungry. And Malia. <laughs> Kids love to be in the videos. They like to watch themselves. So she comes, pops in every now and then, trying to get in the video here. And as you can tell, they're all in the background talking to me. Mom, Mom, I need this. Of course, she needed something out of the fridge. Broccoli, mm, my favorite. Not Jared's favorite, but my favorite. So he gets mushrooms, I get broccoli. Cut the stem off and then I cut the little flower. It's really small. Like I said, it helps it cook down a little bit better where it's not too crunchy in the, um, the burritos. Mm, there's Jared. He's like, oh, thanks, babe. Broccoli. Ah, <laughs> uh, Cole. Loves broccoli. He will eat broccoli, raw broccoli. He doesn't really care for cooked broccoli, but he does like raw broccoli. Look, I'm still eating my broccoli there. This is an avocado. Avocados are super, super healthy for you. I'm not a real big fan of them. I will eat them. We usually do not put them in the burritos. We slice them after and we eat them with it. A lot of times they get, um, they're not really good if you heat them. So we eat it, we slice them and eat them on the side. I use a lot of egg whites. So I, um, I just use my eggshell to get the egg white out, leave the yellow on the side. Now I do put a few yellows in. So out of all the eggs, I'll usually put four or five yellows in. I think I use maybe five this time, five or six. But egg whites are a whole lot more healthy for you. James, oh my goodness. My little boys love to crack an egg. Every time they see me crack eggs, I want to crack an egg. So I always get them in their own little cup and I let them crack an egg. Makes them feel like, you know, they're helping out on the part and it's teaching them. So I drizzle olive oil in the bottom of my pan and then I add all my ingredients. As you can see, I didn't have any red onions for this time. I toss all of it in and then I turn it on like a medium, medium heat and let that cook down. It's kind of pretty there. 
all the different colors. Garlic gives it a really good flavor. We like garlic in it. You can use fresh garlic, which will probably give it even more flavor. This is turkey sausage. I just buy turkey sausage, toss it in there. My pretty red pot. And as it cooks down, you can see the spinach gets a little bit smaller. This is just the veggies. This is about when it's all cooked down, soft. And then I add my eggs. I use season all this time. You can use whatever type of seasoning you want. Sometimes I use Tony Sacheries, sometimes I use season all. Whatever you enjoy seasoning with. Then I cook my eggs into it, stir frequently so it doesn't stick too bad. And then, here we go. We're going to take our filling and put them in burritos. These are small ones, you can get bigger ones. And I also add cheese. You'll see I add some um, shredded cheese in a minute. Just some Mexican style shredded cheese. You can use mozzarella, you can use Parmesan, you can use blue cheese, you can use whatever type of cheese you like. This is the cheese I had on hand for that day. Then I just roll them up, wrap them up. I use parchment paper to hold them together so when you do go to heat them, you just heat them in your parchment paper. Everything stays in them. And then I cover them with aluminum foil to store them in the fridge. I think this time I made 16 or 17 burritos out of this batch. With Jared, I and a couple of our kids eating it, they do go quick. Three for each morning, so that'll last us a few mornings. There's your avocado and salsa if you want to add it in. Again, thank you to all those who have joined our crew. If you have not subscribed, please hit the subscribe button now. If you want our latest upload, hit the bell notification to be notified when we post a video. Over the next few weeks, we will continue to try and release a weekly Trying to Get Fit Over 40 video. And remember, our regular vlog premieres Thursdays at 8 p.m. Thanks for watching.